From being considered a struggling nation to now being recognized as one of the fastest growing economies in the world, Bangladesh has defied expectations in every possible way. But what exactly is fueling this economic engine? What are the secrets behind Bangladesh's rise to economic prominence? Let's explore the fascinating elements that have propelled the South Asian nation to the forefront of global economic discussions. To begin with, we can't talk about Bangladesh's economy without mentioning its booming textile and garment industry. This sector is often hailed as the backbone of the country's economy, contributing a staggering 80% of its export earnings. Bangladesh is the second largest exporter of ready-made garments in the world, right after China. The secret sauce here? It's a combination of a large, low-cost labor force, government support, and favorable trade agreements with Western nations. The country has capitalized on its workforce's skill in producing quality garments at a fraction of the cost of its competitors. The result is a thriving industry that not only drives export revenues, but also provides employment to millions, particularly women, playing a significant role in poverty reduction and women's empowerment. However, it's not just the textile industry that's driving growth. Bangladesh's economy is also benefiting from a strategic focus on diversification. Over the past few years, the government has made a concerted effort to develop other sectors, such as information technology, pharmaceuticals, and agriculture. The IT sector, for instance, is emerging as a new frontier for economic growth. The government's Digital Bangladesh initiative aims to transform the country into a knowledge-based economy, fostering a robust IT ecosystem that supports startups and tech companies. The results are already visible, with Bangladesh becoming a key player in the global outsourcing market, offering services at competitive rates. Another crucial factor behind Bangladesh's economic success is its thriving remittance inflows. Millions of Bangladeshis work abroad, particularly in the Middle East, and send money back home. These remittances contribute significantly to the country's GDP, providing a steady inflow of foreign currency, which helps stabilize the economy and support millions of families. The government has also been proactive in facilitating and encouraging these remittances by improving the banking infrastructure and offering incentives, making it easier and more attractive for expatriates to send money back to Bangladesh. Infrastructure development has also played a pivotal role in Bangladesh's economic journey. The government has invested heavily in building roads, bridges, ports, and power plants, all of which are critical for supporting economic activities. One of the most notable projects is the Padma Bridge, which is expected to boost connectivity between the capital, Dhaka, and the southern parts of the country, unlocking new economic opportunities. Improved infrastructure has made it easier for businesses to operate, reduced transportation costs, and opened up new markets, all of which contribute to economic growth. But while the government's efforts in infrastructure and industrialization are noteworthy, it's essential to recognize the role of grassroots initiatives and microfinance in Bangladesh's economic story. Institutions like Grameen Bank and BRAC have pioneered microfinance models that provide small loans to the poor, particularly women, enabling them to start small businesses and improve their living standards. These initiatives have empowered millions and contributed to poverty alleviation, creating a more inclusive economy where even the most marginalized can participate in economic activities. Another secret to Bangladesh's economic success lies in its demographic dividend. With a young and growing population, the country has a vast labor force that is increasingly educated and skilled. This demographic advantage has been a driving force behind the rapid industrialization and economic expansion seen in recent years. The government has also prioritized education and vocational training, ensuring that the youth are equipped with the skills needed to contribute effectively to the economy. 
This focus on human capital development is positioning Bangladesh as a competitive player on the global stage. Now, let's talk about the government's role in steering the economy. Bangladesh has implemented a series of pragmatic policies that have fostered economic stability and growth. Macroeconomic management, including fiscal discipline and prudent monetary policies, has kept inflation in check and maintained a stable exchange rate. Moreover, the government has been keen on maintaining good relationships with international financial institutions like the World Bank and the International Monetary Fund, which has helped in securing necessary funding for development projects and maintaining investor confidence. Speaking of investors, Foreign Direct Investment FDI, has been another cornerstone of the country's economic growth. The government has created a favorable business environment by offering tax incentives, establishing special economic zones, and simplifying the process for foreign companies to invest in Bangladesh. These efforts have attracted significant FDI, particularly in sectors like manufacturing, energy, and telecommunications, further bolstering the economy. However, it's important to note that while Bangladesh's economy is booming, it's not without challenges. The country faces issues such as income inequality, environmental degradation, and political instability, which could potentially hinder long-term growth. Additionally, the heavy reliance on the garment industry makes the economy vulnerable to global market fluctuations and changes in trade policies, particularly from major buyers like the United States and the European Union. To sustain its growth trajectory, Bangladesh will need to continue diversifying its economy, investing in sustainable practices, and addressing the socio-economic challenges that remain. But there's still a lot ahead, and how they handle challenges will be key. If you enjoyed this look into Bangladesh's economic journey, hit that like button, share with your friends, and subscribe for more. Got any questions or thoughts? Drop them in the comments. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for tuning in and catch you in the next one.